Simple can be harder than complex. You have to work hard to get your thinking clean to make it simple, but it's worth it in the end because once you get there, you can move mountains. That's a quote by Steve Jobs, and it was published in a Business Week article in 1998. And this idea of simplicity is at the core of the book that I'm going to talk to you about this week, which is Insanely Simple, The Obsession That Drives Apple Success by Ken Segal. Now, this book is a really special one for me. Um, you know, for a number of years, I worked in Apple's creative team and literally on the wall that I walked by every single day was a mantra. You had to walk past it to even enter the office. And it simply said, simplify, 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 except the first two uh, words simplify were crossed out. And this idea of simplifying, just ruthlessly simplifying, Simplifying and trying to get to something simple is at the core of what Apple's been able to create, both in terms of the incredible products, but also in terms of things like company strategy and pricing strategy. And so this book, uh, Insanely Simple by Ken Segal, is really special for a couple of reasons I'm going to give you quickly. Number one, it's filled with just incredible stories. It talks about the creation of the Think Different campaign. It talks about uh, the origin story of uh, naming the iMac and how the iMac was actually a name that Ken Segal proposed and didn't think was going to win out against something called MacMan, which was the original name proposed by Phil Schiller. And as you know, you know iMac was the genesis of the iBlank kind of naming framework that Apple's used for iPhone, iPod, um, you know iPad products. It's become synonymous, and so it's filled with incredible stories, but it's also filled with incredible principles. Uh, not that I think apply to anything, whether what you're creating is a physical object like a car or a piece of software. And it's really special because it works on two levels. It's both talking about how simplicity can be applied at the business and strategy level, as well as at the product, kind of the foundational tactical, uh, you know, ground level of your business. Uh, and so it's an incredible book. Highly, highly, highly recommend it. Um, I think it's one of the best ways to truly understand how Apple operates and how it thinks. For more, listen to episode 173 or visit outlieracademy.com slash insanely simple.